guys, welcome back to Leo Time. If you are a returning subscriber, then welcome back. If you are new, hi. This is a channel about leopard geckos and their care and information and more. This video is going to be really exciting and fun, and it will have some information in it. So basically, I just feel really bad because I had a bag lossage, and so basically, I haven't been able to film for a little bit. I will make a note to myself to film every single week at least once, and if I don't, I will make it up to you guys, I promise. But today, we're going to do a little bit of information on leopard geckos and a lot of nighthawk. Because why not? So, see ya in the video. Okay, guys. So, right now we're going to do a feeding of Nighthawk. He, if you have never seen a leopard gecko eat, it is actually a pretty funny thing. So, he's right now, I think. I don't know what he's doing. He's trying to find the um, earworm placed in front of him. So, I'm just going to let him do that. I thought he killed it. Turns out he didn't. Whatever. So there's another male one for you, bud. So that's basically a leopard gecko eating. Um, this is Nighthawk if you've never seen him before. He is my leopard gecko. He is about, oh, I don't know how old he is. He is less than a year. September 25th, he will be six months old. So, yeah. He does not realize there is a mealworm. Like, there's two mealworms over behind him. But, yeah, I finally found a really good lighting for this. It's great. So now I can kind of show you from the side view without a horrific blur. Nighthawk, please come over here. Uh, there's three mealworms in the exact same spot. So this is basically him eating. It's actually quite fun watching it. The first time I saw him do this, I laughed. And he's going for the kill. And he doesn't eat it, so. This is interesting. Don't know why he's doing this. But yeah, this is basically him eating. So we will get on to the next thing. Bye. Okay, guys, so we're back with Nighthawk. If you've never seen his cage before and you're new, go check out other videos because I actually remodeled his cage. So I'm going to give you a cage tour while he is still hunting for a mealworm that is buried in his dirt. So right here we have his moist hide. I made it myself. There's moss inside as you can kind of see. He's going to demonstrate that for us. Um, here's his calcium bowl. Right here, there's actually a hide, like, in this general area. I'll show that to you. I'll pull up a picture about now. So that's what the hide looks like in this area. We have, just for um sake of him coming out, he's kind of camera shy, just for the sake of showing him, showing Nighthawk and other things, we have, that's why I took it out. So he he thinks there's a, there is a mealworm hidden in the dirt. And I think he can hear it like rustling around. So that's what he's up to in the background. So there's two rocks here that he likes to sunbathe on because they collect heat. Here, actually, this is new. This is um, a pot I made with rocks on it. If you can see. And then I have a little succulent in here because it's really hard to keep a succulent in this dirt without having a lot of it. Some of you might um, disagree with the level of ego earth I have here. I keep saying dirt, that's because it kind of looks like dirt. It's ego earth, 
You might disagree with it, and you might like, if you have a leopard gecko, gecko, you might like to keep it, like, up to this thickness. Come here. And so, I just keep, he's, he's convinced he hears something. So, I just keep it pretty low, because I keep it, like, thicker over here in this area and the colder side. Over here, I keep it really thin, like, especially if you can see under where the hide should go, right there. It's really thin, so that the heat can come through. And then I kind of have to take you... And then he has his hammock. Those two are wires. He has a background. One of the wires is to the heat mat under here. Um, you might be able to see it, but I'm not sure. So that little black thing is a heat mat. And we have stand. Then we have his hammock, which he can access on his little house that goes there. Whoa! It is there. Um, then we have his thermometer. It, okay, his temperature is not at 100 degrees Fahrenheit. That is because this light that I am using, just, I never use this. This is filming. It's producing a lot of heat on top of the thermometer, um, like, throw probe or whatever it's called and so yeah it's actually in between 80 and mm, barely reaches 90 but sometimes does he sees the mealworm again this is really funny okay so over here we have his water dish we have an air plant well this actually produces a lot of heat i can like smell it i have an air plant and we have this cute thing that says lake, nature trail, and campground. It's really cute. It's a little bird. He's digging, which he never does. Maybe there's a mealworm. But I've never seen him do this before. I really hope this is a boy, not a girl, because that would be strange. Why is he teaching? So that's the end of the video. I just want to make it a short one, so it's basically a cage tour while Nighthawk kind of does his own weird things. I have never seen him digging before, which I'm kind of glad I caught on camera. I just put the hide back in. He is currently in his cold hide because that was there. I just put the warm hide back in. So he has like a digging area. So yeah. Bye. Please subscribe down below to help Nighthawk. Give this video a thumbs up. And go ahead and tell like your friends about this or anyone really. Just because it would really help my channel. If we can get to a certain amount of scoop subscribers i mean subscribers um we it would be amazing i really want to try to get okay we're about we're at about 10 or 11 subscribers right now i want to try to get to 20 if we can i will do a fun video for that either like i'm not sure i'll do something really fun so bye subscribe and hit that notification bell and like